Hi everyone, this is Mr. Social, and this is the weekly update for 4.17, no, 4.18 to 4.24-2021. So let's begin with the obvious. How are we doing physically? Feeling okay, you know, um, no uh, big health issues. So we're doing okay there. Um, mentally, I'm just, I'm just, I'm done with school. Um, I'm sort of on cruise control slash survival mode. Uh, so whenever I'm just ready for this semester to be over. Uh, it has been the most draining because I, it, this semester has made me wonder why I'm sinking money into continuing my education. That's pretty much it. Um, it's like most of this stuff, it's like, why don't you just, why don't you just give me some links to some YouTube videos? Um, because that's basically what it's been like, um, whether that be on Zoom or whether that be 100% online. Um, it really, it has not been the best. It's not been the most engaging. And if it's not engaging, I don't learn anything. So um, uh, there's that. Um, and that has definitely um, sort of uh, influenced other areas where it's like, I. I hardly if ever meditate now. It's like, um, I, cause I, I think probably what it is, uh, not like a super conscious level, but sort of in the back of my head, I'm saying, well, all those issues you've been having since school started are going to come to the forefront of your meditation. You don't want that, do you? And it's like, well, maybe not. So maybe that's one particular influence, um, on it. But to be honest with you, the last time I meditated, none of that garbage happened um and if it did it was like well it is what it is you know that's sort of like the number one phrase in meditation when something pops up it's like well it is what it is and then uh you sort of just let it go um as much as possible of course there are some things where it's like well i probably shouldn't just let this go i should address it so that when it arises you know it doesn't invade my mind again um but for the most part it's like okay well, it is what it is, and then you move on and go back to focusing on the breath or whatever. Um, so that's sort of what happened last time. I was just like, whatever, man. You know, that's it's cool that um, you feel that way. Um, let's just uh, move on and let's try and re re uh, calibrate and refocus. Um, but and spiritually, I've really been leaning on uh, some of the the Buddhist teachings, especially on impermanence, uh, where it's like. Yeah, this is this has been a garbage semester, but it can't last forever because it's impermanent. Um, and also, you know, impermanence on a more um, specific level, um, being like on the day-to-day -day level, where it's like, well, um, everything is transitory, everything's impermanent, and that includes your frustrations. And so, being able to say, yeah, you're frustrated, um, but eventually that will pass. Um, it, it's difficult um, to pass when you sort of hold on to it because you're like, you're frustrated all the time. Uh, because that's how I felt. Um, so much so that it's like, why why did I even use um, some of my education award to go back if what I'm getting is a YouTube education, basically? Um, that's my opinion, so don't take it as fact. Um, that's my opinion of it. But if that's the way, and I'm sure I'm not the only one that feels that way. Um, um, there are a couple classmates that I have spoken to where they feel very, it, it's very similar. Their feelings are very similar. So, and we sort of been, you know, leaning on each other a little bit when it, when it gets too much. And it's just like, yeah, I know exactly, and maybe not exactly, but I have a pretty good idea what you're going through. We're all a little bit different. So how we experience things is always going to be a little bit different. So changing gears from that, I feel a little bit better about being out and about, uh, because the um, violent actions here in the Rochester area have sort of gone back up toward the north. And um, that's that's actually, you know, it makes me feel a little more secure where I am. But I can only imagine if you're in these areas that have seen a lot of um, the um, armed carjackings or a shooting or over we had a shooting over a dispute um, this weekend. Um, that that can't make people feel really a hundred percent secure. Um, I don't think we we ever feel a hundred percent secure, um, but you know just a general feeling of safety. Um, I think that's probably been a little bit 
difficult to come by uh, in the areas where there's been a lot of this uh, violent activity. So, um, but it's been a little bit farther away uh, from where I am, so I feel a little bit better about it. Uh, that being said, that doesn't mean that I'm like, yay, things things are great again. It's it, it's still just as piss poor as it was. Um, so I have been streaming on Twitch uh, every late afternoon uh, between 5 and 5.30 is usually the time I try to start. And I usually don't go for much longer than an hour and a half if I can handle it. Um, so usually an hour to hour and a half. And it's it's mostly for like, you know, Getting, ri uh, getting some of the stress um, out there um, by playing the game and interacting with people who stop by. Um, and it, it's it's one of the times uh, during the day where it's like, yeah, it's not it's not half bad. Um, and I also play games that I like, um, and they're not the most popular games now. I mean, uh, The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion was released in 2006, so 15 years ago. And, you know, even Fallout 3 is like 2008 or something like that. So um, they're just older games at this point. I've uh, played a couple of other games that I haven't played before, like uh, Bioshock, and that's different. Um, I'm not sure if it's good, different, or bad, different. I really haven't put enough time in it. Um, Kingdom uh, Come Deliverance, I don't know what people see in that game. Um, that being said, I've only played like an hour into it, um, and it's just, I cannot stand the main character, and how, I, I really, I really shouldn't go off on this, because in reality, he's playing the role that he's supposed to play, historically speaking, but it's just so dumb, and dim-witted, uh, his attitudes and everything, that it just frustrates me, and it's like, I hope, you know, even back in those times, I wouldn't be as dim-witted as this character starts out to be. And maybe as the story progresses, he isn't as dim-witted and becomes more mature. Um, but I just didn't have the patience for it. I uninstalled the game. And I said, you know what, if I if I want to try it again, I'll reinstall it. But right now, I, I don't want this on my hard drive, taking up all that hard drive space. If I'm not, I'm not, I don't really want to play it. That's the... That's the big thing. Um, so that's really about all it. Um, that's about it. Uh, there's nothing really like life changing that has happened um, recently. Uh, so when when there is, um, like when I get my second shot and everything, I'll probably feel a little bit better about being out and about a little bit more. I'll still be wearing a mask and everything for safety. Um, but I'll probably feel better about being out and about, and I'll probably have a little bit more to talk about, um, because at some point this semester is going to end, and then I'll actually have more free time to do the things that I actually enjoy, rather than the things that just weigh me down. But that's, that's, I'm not going to rant about it any more than I already have. So until next time, everyone, take care of yourselves, and I'll talk to you soon. Goodbye for now.